he's critical of this play every week. How much does that kind of fire you up? Uh, accountability. Uh, everybody got to hold themselves accountable, and he do a great job of it. He also, you know, he already a great leader. And he probably been starting for what about four, five weeks, four weeks. So, um, yeah, it's it's great. Tajay, sorry if we've already answered this, but Tim told us he's not sure if maybe you're feeling a little extra sore after all the usage, especially in the fourth quarter. How are you feeling after that and the way you were able to step up and step in with Derek out? Yeah, back was a little bit sore this week, but uh, I, I'm good, though. Um, it's just, you know, just like any other ball. It's just, you know, you, you take a few days to, you know, work the kinks out and you'll be straight. So, like, what is this, Thursday? I'm, I'm good now. We also talked to Tim about kind of not doing too much as an offense, trying to stay within your game and not get into a, a track meet, trying to be the Dolphins in a sense. Um, how, how do you look at that from your position? Um, you know, definitely they got a lot of fast guys over there, so like we want to like you know do what we do on offense, stick to our keys. But you know, it ain't really about them. It's about us. It's about us staying efficient, us like uh, finishing drive with finishing drive with points and us scoring touchdowns. Uh, in the red zone, out the red zone, you know, us putting points on the board to help our defense and put our b defense in a better situation. With all the injuries that came Sunday, the emotions of the loss as well, where do you feel the morale of the locker room is at? Um, I feel like everybody, like, you know, everybody's still coming together. Everybody, we still feel like we got a job to do. You know, like, we're going to fight. You know, no matter what it is, no matter what it looks like, we're going we're gonna to continue to fight all the way to, you know, the last game of the season, whenever that, whenever that may be. You might kind of say you as far as supporting and, and uh, when I seen him, when I seen him, he was just like, uh, you know, it's a good thing that you care. Uh, you know, we just get back in there and uh, get ready for next week. So, so how, how emotional did you get? Sorry, buddy. Uh, maybe dropped a few tears or something, you know. But uh, I was, I was okay after the game. Though. I was doing pretty fine. What did they do well defensively? Um, what, what maybe concerns you the most? What they're gonna try to do to you on, on Monday night? Uh, defensively, uh, you know, they uh, they move a lot. You know, a lot of movement up front. Uh, you know, they're good in the run game. They fly around. So like I said, we just got to be strong in our technique and our fundamentals and uh, just go out there and have fun. When you went back and watched the film sure. of how you played Sunday, when, what did you see that you liked and what did you see that you didn't like? Uh, I've seen a lot of things I liked, and of course I've seen a lot of things I didn't like. Uh, you know, I just got to keep working on, you know, pad level, hand placement, throwing hands, you know, uh, getting snap count, getting off the ball, you know, so. feel different this week? Most definitely, you know, especially being on Monday night, um, you know, that's a big game because it's a next game and you know uh, quite frankly this is a great team um, and they had a lot of skilled guys track stars and I wish I was out there um, especially you know I love the game of football and injuries sucks it happens but like I said I wish I was out there it's gonna be different uh, of course but um, the way I could keep um, um, being who I am my leadership on the field um, which is I can't be on the field so my leadership off the field is um, gonna come in and live a little more, even just in the uh, film room and watching film, uh, stuff that I, I see on film could point stuff out. Uh, like this week, you know, I was just talking about some of the guards and letting some of the guys know this is what I see. Um, so that's that's the biggest thing, just, you know, my leadership off the field and how can I contribute off the yeah, field. Take us through, take down, us through the take You, you us went through the down end. and then you came back a, a couple plays later and then you went back out again. Was it just a matter like you tried to – See if you could go and you couldn't, or what? yeah. I mean, I went back. I mean, when I, I I got fell on and it happened, and I'm like, okay, I'm, I know I feel fine, and I went back out there, and of course, like with the injury, my leg just felt a little loose. I'm like, all right, this not, you know, what it is. I need to be out there right now, and you know, I told the trainers what it is, and you know, they made a good decision uh, to pull me out of the game, which I was kind of pissed off still. Um, but then the other day, um, you know, they care about our safety, and you know, they made the best decision for myself and the team. Will you travel or you from a, watch from afar? And if you have to watch on TV, what's that going to be like? I'm not sure yet. Um, I haven't, um, Brave haven't told me exactly my plan yet with the traveling um, right now. But, you know, watching <laughs> watching it on the um, TV will be for sure different. Um, you know, last time that happened was, I, I want to say, um, a, what, a couple years ago, you know, having to watch it actually on TV. But, you know, that's part of the game. You know, injuries happen. You know, it sucks. You know, I don't think nobody more than myself just rather be out there on that field. But, you know, stuff happened in this game. And earlier in the week, you know, this team's nominated for the Walter Payton Man of the Year Award. How, how big of an honor was that? And, uh, and I guess that's something you'd always hope to be? Most definitely. You know, it was a, a tremendous honor for me, not just myself, uh, for my family as well. Uh, like I told numerous of people, you know, this this award is, you know, means so much to me. Uh, just, you know, 
everyone knows how much I'm in the community and I'm back at home in Mississippi and here in Nashville. You know, I just want to continue to um, be a light in our community. Like I said, this award just means so much to me. Um, you know, it's for a way to stand for it, especially just, you know, because a lot of the things you do in the community, you know, it's for people who are pretty much unfortunate. And, and uh, a lot of my stuff I do, it's around my foundation and it's dealing with the youth. So, um, you know, that's my goal is to continue to be a light, um, you know, no matter, you know, it, of course it's a nominee, but no matter if I win this award this year or not, um, you know, my goal is to continue to be in the community no matter what. When you came here, you made a promise that that was what you were going to do, and now you have this award. Do you ever stop and look back at, like, how far you've come along since you first got here? Most definitely, man. You, you always just, um, you want to continue to see how you could grow um, as a person. Um, of course, because I'm an uh, athlete, you want to continue to each year. To just you know, one thing about like what I do, I kind of write, write down my goals every year. Um, you know, and not just football goals, but life goals. And you know, you look back at them goals from your rookie year when you first got in the league up until now, um, which I've been doing that for a while now since I've been in college. And you just look back and be like, man, you know, thanks to the man above for the growth. Thanks for the man above just for you know molding me to, to be the man I am today. So. Um, I, I do think I have grown a lot. Um, you know, that's the goal each and every year, each and every day for me to be better than I was the day before. So, and <clears throat> you go, you talk about the years. You know, when I first got in the league, and that's like I said, my goal is to be better than I was when I first walked in this league.